The goal of our flying labs, like here at Nepal Flying Labs, is to create local robotic capacity. Over the last nine months, technical trainings were organized, followed by first projects to apply the newly learned skills. However, to not only create robotics capacity, but to grow the market and make it sustainable, technical knowledge is only part of the answer. As all of our trainees are engineers, business skills are not their strengths, and acquiring them is essential to create, grow, and sustain their business. For this reason, our Flying Labs framework also includes a business incubation program. Throughout the last two months, we have organized such a program here in Nepal, focusing on creating businesses using drones as a service. After an ideation phase in which over 30 teams participated, a jury selected four finalist teams. This week, we trained these four teams on how to turn their idea into a solid and sustainable business plan. And we also take time to have them interact with important stakeholders, like the Nepalese Home Ministry and civil aviation authorities. Our finalists are all eager learners, including on how to use sticky notes. And our goal is to give them a business kickstart using easy applicable tools to build a compelling business plan. Um, so, coming here to this program organized by We Robotics, uh, we have learned a lot of business tools and equipments that we can actually use in our business. We knew the problem, we knew the solution, but we didn't know, we didn't have any idea how to take that solution to the market, how to make it viable for the people out there. Because a solution is only usable if the people wants to use it and if he has any use out of it, right? So I learned a lot about how to develop my business, how to put my ideas into words, and it was a good team building exercise. Before coming here, uh, I couldn't call myself as an entrepreneur, but I think this program has made me an entrepreneur and my team as well. So thank you so much. After this training, we, everything that were in our mind are systematically placed in a business model. So now we can look at the, um, each and every parts of our business and uh, iterate it so that we can have a great business model. So Before this program, we had bonds of our engineers and our IT experts and geomatics engineers working on different fields and this sounds to be a great benefit for us. After attending these sessions, all of the business plans and the canvas models all turn all turning our ideas into a bit of like we are having wings and I think sky is the limit we are going to touch and making our idea into reality seems to be uh, seems to be viable now. Thank you. Now it's up to the four finalist teams to validate the work they've accomplished during this week's seminar with their future customers and stakeholders and to create the compelling pitch to win the final that will be held in six weeks.